Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Con's Delicious Potato Chips. This is the cinnamon and sugar. A uh, Hawaiian sweet onion, and then we have green onion. These were $2.50 a bag at Jungle Gems International Market. They're actually made in Zanesville, Ohio, and we've never seen this brand before. Mm -hmm. no. uh, we actually bought six bags, uh, so we decided to split them up into this video and another video. Um, Con's Potato Chip Company. It says, uh, oh, they're giving you a recipe on the back no. for Angie Con's Fried Ice Cream. Two scoops of vanilla ice cream, add crushed con cinnamon and sugar potato chips, and add your favorite topping. Um, so you're using that as a breading. You're using this as your breading, yes. Uh, seven and a half servings per container. One ounce, 28.3 grams, about 15 chips is 155 calories. That's about normal. It is. www.conschips.com. Okay. They also had two other varieties. One was a flaming Hot, and one was something else that we just weren't interested in. I don't remember what it was. Maybe um, truffle. Huh? Truffle? I know, truffle, that's the only thing I can think of, is like truffle would be the only thing we wouldn't be interested in. But definitely, you know, the flaming Hot. Even if it had been like habanero, I probably would have tried it, but not. The yeah. Flamin' Hot, just hot. Okay, I found a fold over, a big fold over. These are nice, um, Big chips and they're nice and wavy. Very sweet. I like the amount of sweetness they put on there. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. It's weird though. Um, Cause there's some salt there too. Well, it has, you get the cinnamon sugar flavor like you would on a churro. Mm -hmm. However, you taste the underlying potato chip. Mm -hmm. And it's salty. Like yeah. the potato chip is a salty, good, good salty potato chip. So it's odd to have the cinnamon and sugar and in the potato. As but well. I like it. Yeah. I do like it. It's it's like, mm, that's I could go eat half that bag. <laughs> years ago, uh, yeah, I mean years ago, like when we first started doing YouTube, um, Pringles had a potato chip uh, as cinnamon. And... Um, I don't remember if I like, it seems like I did not like it. They also had like a white chocolate one. I've never really been a fan of the chocolate covered potato chips. Right. I could do these though. Yeah, they're really nice. Mm -hmm. yeah. These I could do if I wanted a sweet potato chip. Mm -hmm. um, because, it is different though. Mm -hmm. Because it you don't think different. of potatoes as sweet, but, no. but these are good. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I love the texture. The textures, it's not, they're not hard. They're good thick potato chips, yeah. but they're not hard potato chips. No, it really is nice. And you know, you potato chips, when you mention the texture, you think of dipping. You could dip that in like a uh, no, a frosting. Yeah, you could. Yeah. No. And that would be wonderful because that, the uh, like a cream cheese frosting with that cinnamon sugar would be delicious. Mm -hmm. Um, this is the Hawaiian sweet onion, and same, almost the same calories. 15 chips, 150 calories. So. Did they have original? I don't know where they had. Maybe that was it. I, I, I bet that was it. I bet they had original and, and flaming well, hot, yeah. and we're like, well, we don't need to try the original. Yeah. I bet you that's what it was. Maybe it was. Because I'm thinking the other ones we bought are like. Uh, variations on barbecue. Uh, so, now these are very flat. They're a different texture, too. Oh, wow. They're kind of hard. I love the flavor, though. That will be too much for some people. It's very oniony. Mm -hmm. But it is a sweet onion. It's not like a sharp raw onion. It is a sweeter onion, like a bidet onion. That is... I like it. We've had a lot of... breath's gonna stink. We've had a <laughs> lot of sweet onion potato chips. This is by far the um, most coated, mm -hmm. the thickest coating we've had on the sweet onion potato chips. Um, I love it. But it will catch you off guard when yeah. you put it in your And some mouth. people won't like it, like you said. Some people will not like it because it's so very, very strong. I'm impressed. Mm -hmm. It's like, oh, wow, potato chips can have that much um, coating on each one. Well, why doesn't Lay's do that? Why don't they add more? I love Lay's, but, you know, give me some more on some of them. Um, 
They should do an extra coating. Well, um, they did, they have like Ruffles has had those like the extremes or whatever. They're supposed to be extreme yeah, but not Lay's. Stuff. Lay's and, hasn't. But even those aren't like this. This is. I'm telling you, they put like triple coating yeah, on these. It's very, very, very good. And you're either gonna love it or it's gonna be too much for you. For me, I love it, and it is a very, very sweet onion flavor. Mm -hmm. yep. It's like those uh, Maui chips that we've yep. had before. These are stronger than these, those. Though. Oh yeah, <laughs> these are the strongest. I'm yeah. telling you, as far as that sweet onion. Now I've noticed a lot of these have like these dark patches in them. There's a bunch of them. I ate one like that, and, and it, I did not taste okay. anything. That's what I was wondering because no. sometimes they have a bitterness to them. Yes, I didn't taste anything. And that's, that's what I was wondering. Yeah. Okay, now these are rippled again. These are the green onion. What did you think about the texture of those too? They're different than like, they're not I mind crunchy the crunchy, but they're, they're a little bit softer crunch. I didn't mind the texture. No, um, they're not, they're just um, different. They're not greasy like a Lay's. Oh gosh. Because all the grease is soaked uh, up with all the powder. I see a fold over. I'm going to get it now. Mm -hmm. All the grease is soaked up by the powder. Yeah. yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh, there's some good fold over. Monster fold over right there. <laughs> Tammy's got everybody thinking fold overs when they eat potato chips. That's a good thing. Okay. I tell you what, after eating that Hawaiian one, these were like, where'd the flavor go? <laughs> that Hawaiian one is so sweet, but it'll almost burn your mouth off because it's, um, yeah. I get the onion with that, but it's nowhere near as strong. It's it's more like a it's more like a lay sour cream and onion level of flavor. It may be actually a little lighter even than that. We need to find you a fold over, unless you want to eat that one. I want you to eat a fold over specifically because the texture of that fold over is different than any texture I've had before. It is it's crunchy, but it's not hard. It's not crispy like uh, like the Doritos Double Crisp or whatever. Right. Double Crunch, I think it's called. The ripples. Those are hard. Mm -hmm. That is not hard. No, that is a nice soft soft crunch. crunch. Yes. Just like the um, the first ones were, the cinnamon ones. This. Uh, I like those actually now that I've eaten a couple more. You can taste it better. The, the, the flavor is a little stronger yeah. than I originally thought. It was just kind of right off of those sweet onion ones. These seem pretty mild, but after you, if you were just eating these by themselves, you would be perfectly fine. They're they're nice and strong onion flavor. Usually, we try to try we try to review things in the order that we think it's going to be lightest to strongest. Well, the, who would have known? Who would have known that the Hawaiian sweet onion that's the strongest one here? Mm -hmm. Really, um, I love these both of these though, and I, like I do the like onion. the onion. Yeah, the, uh, even the sweet ones, which is not appealing to everybody, but I think they're really really good. I think they are too. And it makes me very, very excited to try the next three because these were so nice. Now, the bad thing is we can't get these here. Yeah, no, they're not that, I mean, Ohio is just the next state yeah. up from us. It seems like they would ship around mm -hmm. this area. Yes. But I guess and they just don't come down this far south. Uh, something too is I would like to see a variety box with, of small with, with all the flavors, yes, they need. They to, might. They need to do uh, a box of all the flavors in, in a small and regular packages because I have to have portion control. And yes, you could take them and weigh them out and all that. Done that. But <laughs> we would rather buy them in a variety box. Yeah, I would rather spend a little bit more money on individual bags mm -hmm. than one big bag. Yes, that's just how we are. We want it for the convenience. And you can take them with you someplace, right. you know? I have weighed out chips and stuff in, yeah. in Ziploc oh, bags, yeah. weighed them and, and keep your calories at a certain amount. But if they're not doing a variety box, they're missing a market because I'm telling you, we would buy a variety box mm -hmm. of these. These are excellent. All of them are excellent. Yeah, really but good. which one is your favorite? Which one would I want to eat all the time? All the time. Probably the green onion. Okay. Because the sweet, the Hawaiian one is just so, so, so strong. Mm -hmm. that I don't know if I'd want that strong of a flavor. All know. the time. Yeah. I mean, if I eat a sandwich or something, I don't really want that strong flavor. I want something a little milder. But now if I'm eating them for a snack by themselves, then I want the strong flavor. Right. So really it's just situational. Right. But I would probably buy the green onion. And I'm gonna buy the Hawaiian. Yeah, they're yeah. really good. Yeah, yeah. This has been a surprise because you just never know when you pick up a new brand. Is this gonna be some kind of off yeah. brand or what? This is actually really, really good, and I'm, I wish they sold them around. And here. there's absolutely not one thing wrong with the sweet no, one. I just when sweet. I eat, when I want a snack, 
I don't, and I think potato chips, I don't want a sweet potato chip, but they're very good. Yes, they I are. Have. Yes, they are. So if you've had this brand, tell us if you are outside of Ohio yeah. and you've seen this brand, what state are you in? Yeah. Because we're right down from them in Kentucky and we've never seen them They're here. They're shipping them to California. However, <laughs> people in Northern Kentucky, right across the river, they you know. might see them. Yeah. So let us know where you're seeing this brand because I really do think they, uh, as far as these go, they deserve uh, more yeah, uh, recognition. Yeah. yeah, Like I said, the price selling them in California. <laughs> That'd be funny. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.